You're not posting that on YouTube, are you? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so we're going to do a deck profile. We're going to do my eldest daughter Heidi's deck. And this is her uh, shadow deck that is based around Mewtwo. It's psychic. Psychic. Oh, same thing, maybe. No, no it's I... not. They're two different um, types. Fine. School dad. So this is the deck that she's playing with currently. And, so we'll start in the top left. Up here she has a whole bunch of energies. She actually plays with quite a bit. I know the standard rule of thumb is that it's 20 energy, 20 trainers, and 20 Pokemon. She, however, has decided that she is going to use more energy cards. So she has, like, what is it, 17 psychic energy, 5 fighting energy, and 2 double... Colorless energy. So that's what, 24 energy cards? So that was her decision to do so. Do you have an explanation? Um, yeah, actually. You'll notice how there's these fighter cards. Well, that's because of this. A Mega Mewtwo EX. Yes, we are really seeing this. You're pretty excited we got that card, aren't you? Yep. Okay. So, we have the fighting energy to back up Mega Mewtwo. So that yes. explains that. So that's the energy cards. We're just going to stack them up here so that uh, we have a little more room. Alright, Heidi, do you want to explain the rest of your trainer cards there? Um, what do you mean by explain Well, them? explain. Here, here's the first one. It's the trainer card, it's an item card, it's a switch. What does switch do? It switches your active Pokemon with one of your benched Pokemon. That's awesome. So if your Pokemon's taking damage or something, you can switch it out, right? Or if all of a sudden you get... This guy, then you can use that switch card. Okay. Alright, so that's that one. What do we got next? Uh, next we've got a potion, which heals 20 damage from one of your Pokemon. Okay, cool. And because it doesn't say specifically, that means it can be benched, it can be active. But it's actually different from the games. In the games, it's 20 damage for a potion. Oh, neat. Just figured I'd add that in. Yeah, that's cool. What else we got there? We've got Revive. And you got two of those. Which puts a basic Pokemon from your discard pile onto your bench. This is actually very helpful. Cool. So you got two of those in there. Yep. Awesome. All right, so what's next? Next, we've got Brock's Grit. So, this says, Shuffle six in any combination of Pokemon and basic energy cards from your discard pile into your deck. Oh, well, that's pretty good. So, if one of your Mewtwo's get taken out or something, you need to bring them back in, you can. Yep. Nice. What else we got? We've got this energy pouch. What's that do? It, if the Pokemon this card is attached to is knocked out by damage from an opponent's attack, put a basic energy attached to that Pokemon into your hand. Oh, nice. Okay, and then I see we've got three full heal cards, which remove special conditions from your active Pokemon, which is good because, you know, Dad likes to poison your Pokemon, right? And paralyze it. And paralyze it, so that'll help you. What else we got? We've got Misty's Determination. Discard a card from your hand. If you do, look at the top eight cards of your deck and put one of them into your hand. Shuffle the other cards back into your deck. Oh, nice. So it's almost like pick whatever card you want and put it in your hand. Yeah, pretty much. Nice. All right, and what else we got? Oh, we got two Tiernos. Oh, and we also have two of Misty's Determination. We don't want to forget that. Tierno. This is super basic. Draw three cards. That's basic. But it might be helpful because you just might get this guy. Yes, we know. We might get that guy. All right, what else we got? We've got a, is this a hologram? It's a reverse hollow. Energy retrieval. Put two basic energy cards from your discard pile into your hand. 
Nice, so if you end up having to discard them or for one of your Pokemon get knocked out, you can pull energy out of there. That's awesome. And now, let's start off with the least, then we'll go into the awesome stuff. Professor Oak's Hint. Another reverse hologram. Draw cards until you have seven cards in your hand. Your turn ends. Nice, and you got two of those. So it's a good way to get cards into your hand, right? So. And how many trainer cards now do we have in your hand? Or in your deck, I should say. Can I count? Absolutely. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, but you missed the other ones. You got two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen trainer cards. So between... And ten different types. Yeah, so between your energy and your trainer cards, you have forty cards. So that means you actually should only have twenty Pokemon, right? Yep. All right, so let's move these out of the All way. All right, so what do we got for Pokemon here? Let's well, start with this. We got four of these, right? Yep. And what are these? They are Nidorand. Nice. So that's your basic Pokemon, right? Yep. Nice. And you got four of those. And what do they evolve into? They evolve into... Um, stage one is Nidorino. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Nidorino. People need to see it. I'm sorry, people. I've never been on YouTube before. <laughs> All right, so then we got two Nidorinos. We've got... And what's stage three? Or stage two. <laughs> stage two. I'll learn to speak. <laughs> We've got Reverse Hollow, Nido King. Nice, and what, what does he do? His ability is King's Palace. Your Nido Queen... <laughs> Queens? Queens? It says King? I know, it's kind of weird. I don't know. We'll have to figure that one out. Are they genderless or... Maybe. Oh my god. Attacks do 20 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon before applying weakness and resistance. Nifty. And Power Lariat does 60 plus damage, so it'll do 30, mu or 30 more damage for each evolution Pokemon on your bench. That's pretty sweet. So he's a good damage inducer. Yep. Okay. All right, so let's go on to the next one. What else do you want to do next? We've got... Deoxys. Thank you, because I don't know how to say it. Close Encounter. If you go first, you can use this attack on your first turn. Draw two cards. Oh, so that's cool. So it means like when you're first starting the game, if you're the first player, you can normally do... you can't attack, right? Yep. So this one will let you do an attack first. Overdrive Smash. During your next turn, this Pokemon's Overdrive Smash attack does 60 more damage. Cool. Okay. Can I do the other ones before we move on to the main event? What do we got here? We've There's got... two different ones. First we've got... Here, I'll hold this one. Ghastly. Ooh, he's scary. Yeah. Really. Yeah. And so he, scary. He By looks, the way, people... He's got, he's got bangs. By the way, people, that's a little something called sarcasm. This is the internet, after all. <laughs> Alright, so there's Ghastly. Then okay. we've got his stage one evolution. Which is what? Haunter. Nice. Wow, original. <laughs> Alright. What's this one? We've got Hoopa. I like to say his name like that. So. He's one of my favorite guys. Let me just explain the bottom attack, if that's okay. Yep. Is that okay? So, this, his bottom attack is Portal Strike. This Pokemon can't use po Portal Strike during your next turn. Because it's so damaging, you can only use it once every two turns, I guess. Yes. 130 damage. <laughs> We've got Mew. Oh, is this a... That's a hollow Mew. Sweet! His ability is Neutral Shield. Prevent all effects of attacks, including damage, done to this Pokemon by your Pokemon's evolution Pokemon. So you can't use it all the time, only for evolutions. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> cool. Cybolt. 
Flip ahead. If Ted's your opponent active Pokemon is now paralyzed. <laughs> and now for the main event. As oh, you can man. already tell. What's this? This is the main guy. Mewtwo. He's my favorite Pokemon. That's Mewtwo X, one of his Mega Evolutions. And this is Mewtwo Y, my least favorite evolution. I just don't like his design. Please don't hate me. Okay, so let's talk about Mewtwo. Okay. Since that's what this deck is all based upon. Yep. 130 HP. Nice. So that's your standard basic Mewtwo. Right? Yep, then we've got Mewtwo EX. But well, first, on, let's do... We got the Mewtwo X and Y holographic cards, don't we? Yep. They both do the same thing, just different designs. So, this is Cybolt. Flip a coin. If head, your opponent's active pair of Pokemon is now paralyzed. <laughs> Deadly. This Pokemon can't use Zimbly during your next turn because it does 100 damage! That's nothing compared to Mewtwo EX! Am I speaking too much? No, it's fine, go ahead. So, his main attack is Cyburn for 110 damage. Pretty cool, right? Well, it's pretty cool that it's the full art. Yeah, I love those cards. Okay, and then we also got a couple of the regular Mewtwo EX cards. Yeah, those are pretty cool. But then we got his Mega Evolution. Mewtwo E. Mega Mewtwo EX. 230 hit points. Tell me that's not awesome. Vanish. It's Vanishing Strike. Whoops. If there is any Stadium card in play, this attack does 50 more damage. And this attack's damage isn't affected by resistance or any effects on your Pokemon's active Pokemon. Opponent's active Pokemon. Sorry. 150 damage. But that could be 200 damage if there's a Stadium card in play. I know. Like, how crazy is that? So... Not a bad deck to play with. I mean, there's a lot that can, we can improve on, I'm sure. I'm sure there's better Pokemon we can use. What do you guys think? Comment below. Let us know what you think we can use better. What cards we should swap in. What cards we should swap out. You know, help us build a deck. We're both new at this. We're not quite sure what we're doing yet. So, you know, advice is welcome. So make sure you mash that like button or dislike if you didn't like hearing me talk. You know, maybe subscribe too. That would be awesome. You know, comment below. And you know what? Just for kicks. Who wants a free online code? I know I do. Not really. Oh yeah, because you don't play the online game. What? I gotta give my honest opinion. How are you ever going to reach a million subscribers? <laughs> I'll, I'll eat my hat if we reach a million subscribers. <laughs> Literally. I promise you. <laughs> All right, so there's an online code for you guys. Go and enjoy it on Pokemon.com and play the online trading game. Make sure you comment below if you're the one that uses this card and let us know what you managed to get out of it, all right? Cool. All right, guys, until next time, have fun. See ya.